Hey, what is up, guys? This is Rohan from Dragon Burger, back with another video showcasing the LED effects and the gaming software of the Trust Leben mouse. Okay, so this is the main user interface of the software. The software is merely of 8 MB, I think, and is very light. Let's check out the LED effects of the mouse first. Okay, so what you are currently seeing now is the wave effect, which is the default one. Here we have 4 types of effects in total, which are the 7 color breath, full lighted, breathing and wave effect. Let's check out the 7 color breath first. The mouse will keep on breathing in 7 different colors. Let's click on apply and see what happens. And there we have it, the 7 color breath. I will just wait for 7 colors to breathe and then we will move on to the next one. The next one is the full lighted effect. So what this effect will do is light up the color of your choice. Like I have read over here. Let me just apply and show it to you. So the mouse will light up in just one color. One still color, no breathing, just plain color. You can choose from millions of colors like this is light blue. There's also a scroll option for all RGB channels, so you can select the specific color that you want. So suppose I want white, I can select it from over here. And there you have it. The next one is the breathing mode. The LEDs will breathe in a single color of your choice. In this, you can also change the breathing speed of your custom color. I want the color to be pinkish purple and the breathing speed to be high. That's the color that I want with the higher breathing speed. Now I want the breathing color to be in green and the breathing speed to be low. Let's see. Okay, that's that. And the last effect is the wave which you saw in the start of the video. Here you have three options. The brightness level, wave speed and direction. Now there are a total of two directions. Wave from left to right and from right to left. Let's select the low wave speed and direction one and see what happens. So there's the wave in all colors. The wave goes from left and to the right. Personally, this is my favorite effect. Let's check it on a higher speed now. Okay, now the wave is much faster. Let's check direction 2. Uh, let me lower the speed first. Okay, so now you can see properly that the light is going from right to the left. The last one is not an effect. But if you don't want the LEDs, you can always turn them off. I like mine in wave, so I'll keep it at that. So that's all for the effects of the labor mouse. Let's move on to the performance. Over in the performance section, you can change the DP of your mouse. You can have up to 5 DPI per profile.
so I have these five DPI stages. First stage has 1700 DPI, second has 2000, then 3000, 5000, and 15000. Here you can see me change the DPI stages with the help of the DPI buttons on the mouse. Now I want to change the DPI of stage 3 to 100 DPI. So I'll just scroll down the DPI bar and hit apply. Let me just go to stage 3. And now it's a lot harder for me to move the mouse. So that's all for the DPI section. Moving on to the buttons. The mouse has 8 buttons in total. Mm, I want this number 4 fire key to perform some other action. Let's see. Advance and switch window. Let me just open notepad and see if it works or not. Mm. Oh wait, I forgot to click on apply. Okay, let's see. Yep. With one mouse click, I can switch windows now. Let's see some other shortcuts. Now I want to change the functions of the two side buttons. I want this one to be cut. And this one to be paste. Switch window and this is just a cut paste this. So like this. Press the side button and paste. So like this. Cut, press the side button and paste. Yep, it works perfectly. You can also assign combo keys, like this one is Ctrl C for copy. And this one is Ctrl V for paste. Let's check if it's working or not. Switch window, select, copy and paste works fine let me just go over what other things you can do okay you can do basic commands over here in advance there are another bunch of shortcuts then media keys as well you can also set macro functions, so one mouse click can perform a bunch of other tasks in a single click. Then this is the DPI switch. And the last one is the LED mode switch. So with one click you can change the LED effects of the mouse. Now let's try it. Select. Apply. Effect screen and there you have it. One click to switch LED effects. Okay, so now I have applied all these settings and the DPI and now I want to save them. I'll just click on save as, then set the name and click OK. And just to show you, I will reset this profile. Okay, so now everything is back to its factory settings and now I want my older profile back. So I will click on load file, select my profile and hit open. And there's my previous save profile. So yeah, that's it for the LED effects and the software of the Trust Laban mouse. See you in the next one.